Welcome to part two of Secrets of the Clawhammer Banjo. Today's topic is a double stop or partial chord position that I think of as the car horn. It sounds like a traffic jam when the two notes are played together. They're a half step apart. And anywhere, any frets that we put this position in, they will still be a half step apart in G tuning. Oh, I've moved that position here. Frets one and three on strings two and three. old hand. The first note, first five notes of a major scale. I can get A here, B is still open, C here. Same position as the car horn. Here they're a whole step apart. Step and a half apart. <laughs> yeah. Um, of course, because it's a fourth between these and a minor third here. Right. So we can move it here, part of a D chord. Top high ladies. The original car horn, so many uses uh, in, other, in other keys and tunings. I've just brought my bass down, so-called single C tuning. down only if I'm going to play it. It does change the um, sonic atmosphere. Let's see. Um, sure. Jimmy Sutton with a car horn. I just find so many uses for it. And we can also make a, a modified car horn by barring here. We have this one here, this one here, and we're going to hammer. that you can move to different places. If you think of it as a position within which you'll find the notes you need, it greatly enhances the clarity of the playing rather than going one note and then the next note and then the other. That's all. Car horn now finished. Thank <laughs> you.